Cytomegalovirus, commonly known as CMV, is closely related to the viruses that cause chickenpox and mononucleosis, or mono. The symptoms of a congenital CMV infection vary. Most babies infected before birth usually show no symptoms after delivery. Those who do may be born prematurely, have a low birth weight, jaundice, or microcephaly, which is a small head. If not treated properly and in a timely manner, it could lead to premature hearing loss. The challenge is, if we wait too long, those hearing pathways don't develop. If children are not treated, then doing things like cochlear implants doesn't work very well. Furthermore, even if it's not complete hearing loss, these children have significant language delays. Florida is one of the latest states, along with Minnesota and New Jersey, to pass legislation that requires testing for congenital CMV. The bill requires that any baby that fails their newborn hearing screen be tested for cytomegalovirus. If that baby tests positive for cytomegalovirus, it tells us how we have to manage that child. Currently, there's no vaccine to prevent CMV. Washing hands well and often can help reduce the risk of infection. And a mother who has a CMV infection should not stop breastfeeding her baby. I'm Marty Salt reporting.